hold on bear with me you know these are done if y'all have watched my channel y'all know how much i ride for ghd they sent me their um duet style and their new limited edition color i was screaming they reached out to me and i was like next time i take my braids out i'm going to try this y'all i'm so excited this is just like my bag that i keep like stuff that i need to work on or with i've been getting more pr from like luxury brands but one thing that i was able to cross off of my like goals list pretty early this year was working with luxury brands because i've only ever gotten like pr from them your girl has a long-term partnership with prada prada or nada honey that can i disney channel kids can you please tap in here literally i feel like this is like every lipstick that they have and i think i also have the lip balm in here too like is this not like the chicest lip balm i don't know if you guys can see it says like prada on there it's like etched in there i do want to update you guys too on some like supplements and stuff that i'm taking every day i've been taking neutrophil for my hair um this is the hair growth nutraceutical i think it's called um you take four of these a day um, so I'm about like halfway through it by now and I also use their hair serum I do not have an update for you right now I've mentioned this in a couple videos so far and people not on here but on TikTok uh, and people have been like what do you think what do you think give me a minute this is a fish oil 1200 milligrams purified to remove mercury helps support a healthy heart but I also heard that this is good for hair oh we're home from work let's open some back it smells amazing in here mm, some of their soaps their plant milk cleansing bars they smell really nice it's all of them this is Wendy's Mother's Day gift, which I don't mind showing y'all because by the time this goes up, she'll then have got it. She literally sent me a screenshot saying like, tell you and your brothers that I like this. And you know, my brothers got bless them. They don't be know what mama want. If it wasn't for me, that lady would get pajamas and teacups. But I got her these sandals. I'm gonna try these on. These look comfortable. Oh, that is comfortable. Oh, they're, oh. Cute girl. These are from Kate Spade. I don't know if I said that. And then she wanted this purse. I'm just taking this stuff off because I personally, I think it's tacky when you get somebody a gift and it'd be like wrapped with this stuff. I'm gonna leave some of it on, like on the zippers and stuff. But she wanted this bag. Um, I'm gonna say right now, I don't know why my mom wanted this bag because I never see her carry bags like this. Yeah, Wendy, I'm talking about you. Like, Girl, what the hell was that noise? It sounded like the transformer just like settled in my house. I don't know, maybe she's trying to make a change. This is the bag I got her. Isn't that pretty? It's Thursday, so that's usually like my film short form content day. I always use this, always. I don't know how you say it, but that's what it looks like. So I've been using SK2, their essence. I've been using this um, Living Proof Scalp Density, Scalp Care Density Serum. Same eye cream that I use at night confidence in it a gel cream PR so I was like let's use it and then I'm doing an eye mask I've been trying to do these daily now you guys have seen this before this is just like my little area is literally just a little corner by my bed I'm using the Fenty hydrating concealer you could definitely like do this if you haven't already set your face 
This has been my most wearable everyday lip combo. All the hairstyles at the Met Gala. All right, so I just finished all of my content. I got, let's see how many videos I got. That pen is really ODing today. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine videos done. That is what you call batch content creation, people. Also, y'all, I really want a car want to be in a better place financially not that i'm in a bad place but i just want to be in a really really good place before i buy a car i don't know this is maybe this is a little testimony you know how like you will have like your mindset on something like you're like i really like that like for me there's a very specific car that i want it is a luxury car and i was thinking like I was starting to talk myself out of it. I have had cars before, but it was never a car that I purchased myself. I mean like for my first car, I mean like a car that I paid for on my own. You can get up on my car because this is my car now. But then I started thinking and I was like, girl, you make your, your wishes, your wants, your needs known to the Lord and you stay within his will and he will provide. That's just my little testimony for the morning. I don't know who need to go to church this morning, but stop talking yourself out of stuff. All right, y'all, I got a package. I ordered this bag from JW Pie. I don't know how you say it. Um, if you don't know, you can order their bags off of Amazon. And I got this bag specifically. I told y'all I'm going to an event tomorrow and the brand is say beauty and you know how the colors of their brand or the color of their brand is like that periwinkle purple color so i wanted something that like kind of matches up but i'm gonna wear this bag to the event tomorrow just as a nice little like you know not to the brand and i also have a contact there that i'm gonna be meeting in person for the first time seen my little morning routine hopefully a little montage i won't even say i'm tired i'm just like i feel like mentally i've been in my head for like the past couple days just in there you know today we're going to our event i just have to update some work this morning that i had to turn in oh no y'all i just noticed this remember this jw bag i was showing you yesterday look at that you see that that just came from this being on the bag like in the little time that i wore, wore it and tried it on now i'm not saying all jw bags is like that because i have one that they've sent me before like this beige one that's really cute and it's like not like that but these ones that have like all the siding stuff on it like all the just don't get that style and it was like 80 dollars. for 80 dollars, the siding should not be peeling off like that all right so i need to make edits to the l'oreal thing which i did i need to make edits to a youtube sponsorship i'm going to this event at one o'clock i need to film the get ready with me for that so that means i need to be done working by like one thing I put on my list for today, and I'm like kind of dreading it, but I'm going to do it later today so it just doesn't keep getting pushed back. I need to look for an accountant because thankfully, God has like increased my income in such a way that I'm scared and I'm nervous. Like I don't know, know what to do with it. And my biggest fear is like um, blowing 
money. Um, let me correct myself because it, it sounds like I'm irresponsible and I'm very far from it. I'm not irresponsible in that way, but like one of the reasons why I, I tell people don't give me money as a gift because I will find something that is necessary that I need to buy to spend that money on. Like if you gave me $500 and I have a $500 credit card balance right now, I'm gonna pay off my credit card balance. So like, that's what I mean by like, I'll be like, I don't know what I did with it. Like I just need to like figure out like a budget, like for a monthly basis or maybe even it's like a quarterly basis. I need to make sure I get something out for the hair vlog. And then, oh, okay. We picked a Bible plan yesterday, I think. If you guys aren't um, following me on um, Instagram, or if you are, we have our praying beauticians chat. So it's like a chat where like I can chat with you guys, but you can't talk back in it, which I kind of don't like. I wish y'all would be able to talk back. It's 116 of us in this chat. All right, let's pick out an outfit. So I already kind of have an outfit in mind you know what i never i don't know if i've ever showed you guys my closet so i'm gonna zoom out so you can like kind of see it i need to kind of stand from back here so you guys can see it really well so this is what my full closet looks like two doors two sides i took over the whole closet in here so this side of my closet has like blazers jackets it has most of my shoes over here. One thing you will learn about me is I am not a hoarder. Like, I don't like to hoard things. If I don't wear or use it, I will get rid of it. That's why it looks like, dang, girl, you ain't got no shoes. Because if I don't wear them regularly, I'm not going to keep them. And then on this side, it's like my little vanity area. Hi. Um, So this whole thing holds like all of my beauty stuff. So like all the makeup and hair stuff that I currently use, except for this top drawer has like all of my sunglasses in it. And then I have this other like shelving space that holds like all of like my hair tools. If you're ever curious, like where do I keep all these things? Like in that box and then like they're starting to overflow. I need to like do a clean out. Literally any get ready with me where you've seen like a fitted straight leg jean, it's probably these. And these are called, this is the, curvy perfect vintage jean in a size 28. I got this jacket off of Amazon which is very similar to a blue one that I have. I have a navy blue jacket like this with this like silky tank from Zara. Okay this is how the outfit is starting out and then to moisturize my arms and my feet I'll be using a combo. So this is the Laura Mercier look. This is pricey but when I tell you this is the best smelling body cream I've ever used like I want the body spray they also have a hand lotion like I need all of everything in the scent and then this is from Burt's Bees it's their Shea and Mango Glowing Body Oil I'm gonna use this on my feet I use this just for my hair this is the Moroccan Oil Brooms Du Maroc Fragrance Mist you can use it for your body too but I use it just for my hair okay this is cute. I think I'm gonna go with this. Little gold hoops from Jennifer Fisher. Oh, I forgot to add, I need to add some oil on my scalp. This is Donna's recipe um, hair oil on my scalp. And I braid it. And then I wanna take this little gold ring and put it on the end. So it's just like always pulled to the back. Sambas. And I never get to wear them because it's like always like too dark of an outfit. But I think this is like kind of cute. No? Okay. What do we think? Does it look like I'm trying too hard? You guys can tell me that so I will know for future things. As I just want to make sure that like I'm coming correct. And did I go buy this bag specifically for the event? I 100% did. I don't have any regrets about it because i want to be on brand on theme you guys i was getting nervous for nothing when i tell you i had such a good time i wasn't there for that long but i had such a good time so i accomplished both of my goals i met my contact so cute i love him and the whole team was just so nice and then i got some content you guys i'll pop up some pictures of it it is literally so cute. This is the glowy, um, the star glow. Yes, the super glowy gel in the shade star glow. That just goes to show you. Just, just go, just go and do the stuff. Oh! 
<gasps> this this bag is going in the trash. Look at what it did to my jacket. It got that purple goop stuff on the side all over the jacket. It's literally all over the jacket, y'all. And it's like imprinted. This is raggedy. For this bag to have been 80 something dollars, it was almost $80. That's unacceptable. Good morning. I'm just sitting here about to edit um, my video for tomorrow. Literally, I feel like as a content creator, people underestimate how long it literally takes you to edit. I also did a little shopping this morning and I plan on doing like a summertime try on, like summer basics little try on or whatever. I got these shorts from Banana Republic Factory. They're having a sale. I love Banana Republic Factory. Also, I do just wanna say, I know some people think like this type of dressing is like granny or it's like too corporate or whatever. I just like to buy like very classic pieces and then I can dress it up and make it look trendier or more youthful or what, however I want to look with my accessories and stuff. I also got them in black. I also got that white top that she's wearing. This is linen, by the way. Sorry if y'all can hear the washing machine. It is 1.30 now. I'm going over to Wendy's house at two and we're going out. I literally just been in the bed editing stuff, so I made some waffles. And these are some Beyond Meat meatballs. I figured it was like a sausage type of solution. Our tea isn't until 4.30, it's kind of late. This is Mother's Day weekend, and I feel like taking a mom to like tea here is like a, a thing people would think to do for Mother's Day. And then I also want to show you guys these um this stuff that I'm dropping off at the real world. I'm selling some stuff. Like just things that I don't ever wear. I am like, there are things that I don't ever wear that I'm saving for a future daughter or daughter-in-law or, or like niece or whatever. But like first, like these, these Jimmy Choo pumps, I have never worn them. It looks like they've been worn, but literally they've only been worn in the house. Not put them on my food. Um, these are blue snake skin gorgeous they're just not my style michael kors collection cashmere sweater and this is all stuff i got during sample sales um these are some michael kors collection little shorts these shorts and this that would be something cute for like a future daughter huh yeah like just a. I don't know if i i just showed them to you when i put them on earlier so cute i got them off of amazon i have a bunch more jewelry coming um that i bought off amazon and i'm gonna do a whole like amazon haul on jewelry because i feel like i find really good stuff i forgot how much i love this bag and i only wear this bag in the summertime all right i thought that them. yeah i thought that line was for now so i was like it's not like this is a new store it's been they've been had a store sorry mm -hmm. oh that's a cute mm -hmm. no wendy what's the show like no i'm not talking about that Billy didn't look too different. He was just all black. You couldn't stand him. He didn't do nothing to you. You don't have nothing to say for yourself either. <laughs> Wendy, you never, uh, you never said hey to the vlog. I'm hungry. I really well. I did have some waffles and some Beyond Meat meat, uh, meatballs this morning. I can't wait for this tea. I'm gonna eat all these things. He said you want some more. I'm gonna say yes, ma'am. <laughs> I want to bring him, bring the full thing back. Oh, that's a good travel bag. Okay, thank you. This is a nice um, like travel bag. Oh, those those look like you, Wendy. Where do you think those are from? I don't like those either. You know what? Try those on. Those with the gold at the top. Yeah. They look like Angry Bird. Like angry <laughs> no, bird. you don't look like an Angry Bird, but the glasses look like Angry Bird. <laughs> Ooh-wee. You look sharp, Wendy. They look good. My head is too big. I do like rounder sunglasses these days. And uh, lady, just to let you know, that's against city order. What you doing? 
States here, as far as I know, no one to look this beautiful. This <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Arrangement is always so pretty. It is. Uh, great Thank you. Thank you. Maybe it's a white tea. A white tea. They I got some, ooh, okay. I got some stuff from Amazon. And they're supposed to be like dupes for these like Loewe ones. They look so interesting. I bet you as soon as Wendy sees you, she's gonna be like, oh, I want some. Ooh, they're kind of small for my hips, so they might be gone to Wendy. These are interesting. They're not my usual. They're kind of small for my head, not gonna lie. They might go to Wendy. Oh, okay, so they have some new shades of, what is this? Um, their tinted moisture balm. This is a face powder. What the foundation moisture tint. So sorry, there are other people in this house. This is what she looks like. It's like a Jesus whipped. I almost done took my ring off. I want to show y'all. I went to the cobbler. That's the first place me and Wendy went today. And I picked up some shoes um that i had repaired just words to the wise if you have good shoes that you enjoy that you really like instead of getting rid of them like when you done dogged them out before they're like past the point of no return take them to a cobbler it will extend the life of your shoes so much so i have these these are from michael kors collection which is the store one of the stores that we were in today i think it was the first store i took you guys in whenever i will wear these i'll be slipping and falling you see how low this heel is? That's embarrassing to be falling in a heel this little. Um, but it was because this was so like, I don't know, it was slick. I'm gonna try to wear these to church tomorrow. Oh, I don't know y'all. The way these is moving around on my countertops. And I'm just doing a heel. This part is clean. Obviously I've worn these before, but this part is clean, it's brand new. They just put that on. I asked them if they could like rough it up, but it, it looks just like so smooth. You know what? I might take a nail file to this. These are um, a pair of loafers um, that I got from Michael Kors. These are Michael Kors MMK, Michael by Michael Kors. So they completely resold the bottom of the shoe for me. And then, yeah, like it looks like they like just snatched the whole sole off. And replace them and then it looks like they like repainted them and refinished them for me so they're nice pretty and white again when i tell y'all the way these shoes went in there these shoes were talking morning y'all we're heading to church say hey wendy good morning she opened her gift this morning she liked it she forgot she had even asked for it <laughs> they got police on her today <laughs> thank you you look, you play tennis today, when social. <laughs> You can go and I'll find. I've tried these before. I don't want any of these though. But they have, they're supposed to be one for ladies now. This is my favorite. Love Saltaire and this one. The golden one is good too. I didn't see it down here earlier. 
I always see people talking about this. I've never used it though. I guess I don't have it at my Target, but I've seen so many people talk about it. This is the body spray I've been using for like acne and stuff. It's, it works really well for me. Just a spray in the front, spray in the back. I wanna make some mashed potatoes tonight. Nobody asked for this, but I just randomly felt like sharing what was in my bag. This is my bag that I'm carrying or that I carried today. It's a bigger bag. It's one of my favorite bags though. So I guess we can start with like what's on the outside. These are my sunglasses that I wore today. These are one of my favorite pairs. These are like a very summertime-y pair of sunglasses. I love a big aviator like this. My little chanel -y mirror. I always need a mirror because, not just because like I want to look at myself, but I find that I always have something.
I've never really used capers like that for real, but I'm gonna try it today. We're gonna make a virgin Aperol spritz. And we're literally only using three ingredients. I was at Whole Foods and I got this it's called Good Twin Alcohol Removed Less Than 0.5% Alcohol by Volume Sparkling Wine. So that's what I got. So I'm gonna put some ice in here. Aperitif, I don't know. This is the orange stuff that I use. I got it from like a shop by my house. It's local. I literally just pour this into the cup. Just a little bit. We're just gonna pour this in here. Cause that's literally all like at Aperol Spitz is. It's like Prosecco and I think it's like one other thing that's in there. This is the lemon that I washed and everything when I was trying to grate it. Okay, let's see how it tastes. Oh, that's good. Very velvety. That sauce makes a whole thing. It's not the prettiest, I have to say, but it tastes delicious. So I think that's it for the vlog, y'all. I'm about to like devour this, watch whatever movie I've had playing in the background that I've not been paying attention to. I just have to have something I wanna eat. And I think that's it. I will see you guys next time.